Hey guys, how's it going? It's Alpha here, and today I'm taking on Soaring Star Dragon. Um, this is actually the last dungeon I had left in the Dragon Challenge, and it actually gave me the most difficulty. Uh, I died once doing the Legend Plus uh, dungeon, the final one. Um, I died three times, I think, on this dungeon, and that's because uh, I had a bad start with uh, Sakuya team and couldn't recover from it and I went in once with a Shiba Dragon team that I forgot what I was trying to do I think I brought an Echidna that did not work out um, so this team here it's uh, it's the same team I used to take down the 3D dungeon and it's kind of built on the same premise that you're going to uh, use Lilith to get by the high defense low HP monster only here I'm able to use her twice so this is the first time here these stupid shield draws you know they, they give you hell if you've got the element that they're blocking so the first or the yeah the first and the third guys they are super low HP I forget what they are but basically uh, a poison is going to kill them so I wanted to take them out because they'll do a pretty decent shield bash if they all attack you you're done but once you um, get rid of those two, this guy is on red absorb for a while. He doesn't hit that hard. So as long, again, as you match up a, you know, a few combos and you're able to generate hearts uh, pretty much every turn. You see, I don't get them every turn. But most every turn I'm generating hearts, healing up, and I can stall out this guy's fire absorb. And that kind of serves two purposes because... Um, I'm able to stay alive here and get rid of him without using any other actives or whatever because, you know, he obviously makes a bunch of fire orbs. But at the same time, I'm getting my Lilith uh, active skill ready to go again because later on in the dungeon, I've got to take on the Tamadra stage, which goes through the, um, you know, the binding and, and that kind of stuff. So you've got another high defense, low HP stage you have to deal with. So here I'm finally... Um, Done with his absorb, and I think I think that's it. It's just one shot. Yeah. Okay. So that guy's done. Excellent. So now it's some more of the the garbage mobs that they have in these uh, in these dragon challenge things. I mean, I guess not all the stages were like this, but certainly 3D us and the food. Um, I guess I'm saying that right. Um, were like that, but you're pretty much looking at, uh, especially for a team like this, a TPA is going to take out anything. A TPA, a few combos, you're you're good to go. So here. This is the second stage where you can actually, you know, get in some trouble if uh, you're not, you don't have the right team build. So this is why I brought Lilith because I knew I could get her back up after dealing with the fire absorb, and I can hit him with the poison. And I was trying to figure out if I should try to um, clear the bind from Erd right there because Yamato can clear binds, um, but I decided, looking at what's coming up next, which is a keeper. Um, it really wasn't needed. I, you know, I wasn't going on to the final stage. So here, you know, you get the preemptive, and then you have to do, let's see, what's the total HP? It's not a lot, like 1.4 million? Yeah, just shy of 1.5 million. So you've got to hit 1.5 million in three turns. And again, as long as you're, you know, hitting a few combos, generating some orbs, which there was, you know, definitely not a good example of that. Um... You know, that, that was a row, and uh, I think it was just a three combo. But, you know, I'm able to, I think, just combo right through this. And now I've got Erd back up. I've got everyone's actives ready to go. And let's see, do I get through on this turn? I forget if it's this turn or the next, but either way. Um, and there we go. There goes the Keeper. So now we're on to the food. So he has, the one thing he has is a six combo threshold you have to he'll absorb anything under five so i go for the big uh the big kaboom here which is erd and sonata and i look at my board and i'm thinking what the hell i've got all the hearts on one side and popping sonata is going to give me um you know obviously all the the red orbs on the other so i'm trying to figure out what i could do to get to six combos and I know probably for some of you guys that are amazing combos, that's not too difficult, but a board like this, you know, where it's half and half, it's not too easy for me. So 
my solution was, uh, well, it was that. And as you can see, I kind of stupidly got myself to five combos, but I lucked out with the Skyfall and there we go. That is pretty much it. So I guess I kind of lucked through that one in the end, but that was the, the food dungeon. These dungeons are still running for a few more days at the time I'm making these videos. So maybe it gives you a few ideas and you're able to get through a stage that was kind of jamming you up. I hope you guys enjoyed this. If so, please like and subscribe. I'll have some more clears coming up and uh, some more rem pulls and all sorts of other fun stuff. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks. Bye.